Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Just Round Things. I hope you all are good at your places. In this video, I'm gonna talk about why do babies cry. Now crying is absolutely normal with babies as this is the only way they communicate and the communication is the only way crying is the only way of communication and uh, there is no baby in this world who cries for no reason yes they... but you know like what happens there is no parent in this entire world who can see his baby literally crying and it's being very stressful for parents especially new parents to understand what their baby is trying to convey why they are crying what happened to them this all things happen with new parents now typically what happened most of the parents even in the initial days of my parenthood as well uh, pick the baby and rocking them walking here and there distract babies by different toys different sounds of their toys and anything but further i discovered that these all are the ways to prolong the problem one thing i learned from uh, my experience in past 10 months that baby cries for some reason instead of uh, distracting your baby in different activities playing with them um, walk with them find out the real problem why your baby is crying in this video i share some of the reasons why babies cry and uh, i hope this video really helpful for you a lot so let's start the main topic why babies crying problem number one that is hunger 90 percent of the babies cry because of their hunger we all know that their uh, tummy is so small and uh, the procedure of pee and poop is very frequent as the digestive system is not so strong in the early months of their life so they intake milk digest it pee it again this procedure repeat now basically what happens you don't know how much milk you passes to baby while breastfeed and uh, some babies also don't know how much they want to take how much they feel hunger and all sometimes in between feeling uh, and feeding baby sleeps basically hunger cannot be defined by anyone one schedule even if you are a breastfeeder or a formula feeder still the hunger is not satisfied and there is no particular schedule in the early months of the babies when they are going to intake milk when they are hungry we don't know even especially the new parents new parents have no idea even if you know about your baby's intake milk measurements still you are not 100 percent perfect in this so this is the one reason maybe your baby cries because of the hunger Let's come on to the problem number two that's the diaper maybe your baby needs to change the diaper baby needs diaper change very frequently baby pees a lot in small interval of time and uh, their diaper is filled very quickly and you know this is this discomfort feeling for them is really so awkward that they are not telling to you that uh, i want to change my diaper and they are not telling to you that uh, now i have to pee because the only method of communication for them is crying and that's the only one thing you can't teach them that whenever the baby uh, wants to pee baby can tell you i want to pee and uh, uh, you, uh, you can't tell them you can't teach them that whenever you need to uh, change the diaper just tell them because the only only communication method is crying that's why your baby is crying maybe your baby needs diaper to change just compare it with yourself even uh, we are also not comfort in wet clothes or wet uh, wearings so how we expect these things from little ones uh, so uh, if your baby cries from wet diapers quickly change the diaper and now come on to the problem number three which is always happened with me <laughs> that is because of the uh, temperature this is a problem which happens with me usually uh, here in canada now winters are coming and a change of weather is there sometimes uh, it's too hot and sometimes it's too cold like zero degree celsius or one degree celsius and sometimes it's like 17 degree celsius or 18 degree celsius so changing of weather it really um discomfort the babies they are not even supposed to tell you anything that i am feeling hot just uh, pull off my clothes and i am feeling cold now give me the clothes the only method is crying again the communication method is only crying body temperature choice of clothes really plays a role in their babies cry a lot sometimes you overdress your baby sometimes you underdress your baby 
and in between your baby cries you don't understand the reason behind this so just put the right choice of clothes to baby according to the temperature and check their body temperature as well if they uh, if their body is hot and uh, they are sweating uh, so pull off the clothes you are definitely overdressed your baby and if their hands are cold if their feet are clothes definitely you underdress your baby just put on them clothes <laughs> maybe your baby is tired now what happened basically as we all know that babies sleep a lot in initial months of their life and when your baby sleeps give her soothing environment don't make noise don't make a loud music loud television sometimes you just silent your phone rings as well and um, he or she can take the sound sleep uh, otherwise the baby cries irritated uncomfort and uh, in the end babies need rest because when they up they exercise a lot lots of leg movements lot of hand gestures their eyes are working their ears are working and they have not in the habit to do these kind of things so uh, regular and so usual because in the warm they are in the sleeping mode and people holding them they plays a lot ultimately they got tired they need rest maybe a small nap of 5 minutes and maybe a sound sleep of 1 one and a half hour rest could be a small nap or it could be a sound sleep of an hour or two now talk about the problem number 5 problem number 5 is when your babies are alone babies need someone to be around they want to listen sounds of their near ones because in the period of 9 months 24/7 they are in the mother's womb they listen sound from environment and uh, they know this sound is of my family member this sound is of some stranger they feel the touch they feel the presence of someone ultimately they need attention baby cries for none of the reason above mentions definitely they need someone to be with them and so go and uh, uh, cuddle your baby hug your baby play with your baby talk with your baby definitely it works your baby stops crying when you are with your baby definitely these solutions work now, now the problem number 6 which is very very important guys till the problem number 5 you tried everything changing of diaper their body temperature uh, they, if they are not alone if they are with you still they are crying and um, sometime what happens nothing works guys seriously the baby is in pain now it's time to address baby's problem which part is in the pain why baby is crying if you are not understand uh, the why baby is crying definitely there is some internal problem just go to the doctor their pediatrician the child care specialist they will tell you why your baby is crying that's all guys so rather than distract your babies from different sounds toys and rocking position cuddling them find out the real problem why your baby is crying and uh, discomfort and solve it immediately and i hope this video is helpful for all the new parents as this is all the experience which i learn from uh, these things and uh, from the early months when nandika was born so ultimately practice makes the man perfect <laughs> so uh, if you like this video please hit the like button and share it with all the new parents and subscribe my channel guys if you haven't subscribed it till yet subscribe it and become the part of just mom things thank you so much for watching this